Greetings and welcome to the Adamant Temple. My name is Dan Mack and I'm here just to kind of give an update on what I've been doing lately. Um, unlike my last video where I rambled for almost 15 minutes, I'm going to try to keep this quick. So let's start with my externship. Um, I finally finished my externship for my master's degree in forensic psychology. I've applied for graduation and once I finish my reflection paper and my summary, I should be done with school for the foreseeable future. With the internship being done, um, I'll be given more hours of work. Uh, and going back to working, just working, will free up a lot of my time, considering that in the last four months or so, I've spent a lot of time either being an intern, working, or commuting. So 55 to 60 hours a week of doing that has kind of you know taken a toll as far as what I've been available to do. Uh, also, with more time and more work, I'll have... Um, I want to spend as much money on commuting, you know, not paying for tolls and for gas and all that. So I'll actually have some money to save and possibly even devote to some of my projects. Speaking of projects, uh, I spend a lot of time saying that these projects will be done by this time, and although no one has noticed or seemingly cared, I never make good on my promises. But um, I'm just going to say from here on out where I am with certain things, and it'll happen when it happens. First off, um, I have been a guest for two installments of the A Squad video game podcast hosted by Paint It Black Comics. Um, it's a couple of my uh, my brother's friends from uh, from my past who asked me to kind of come by and um, do a little bit for them um, on their on their little video game podcast. Uh, it's basically a weekly discussion of gaming news, um, what the participants are playing at a given time. Uh, we do trivia, we do a little bit of history. You know, it's about an hour, hour and fifteen a, a week or every other week. Uh, but it's been a lot of fun, um, and I'm waiting to hear back about the next one that we're doing. Uh, so you can click here, right there, to subscribe to it. Uh, it's, it's available through iTunes, so just you know, subscribe to the podcast, take a listen. I'm on the last two, like I said, so. Anything before that's not important. Joking. Joking. On Tuesday nights from 7 to 9 p.m. Eastern Time, I usually do, um, I usually co-host the Shred Shack with Pat from Pat's Metal Reviews, who you may have seen in some of my previous videos. Um, I've had some voiceover work in some of his stuff. But uh, it's basically a two hours of heavy metal music and some silly little antics streaming from, uh, from Long Island University's Internet Radio. So you can click for the Facebook page here here. Yep. You can click here for a station's live stream and here for Pat's YouTube channel. These links will also be available in the information below. Uh, check out the show, like the page, subscribe to the channel, and request some songs while we're on the air. Uh, again, it's every Tuesday night from 7 to 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, recreational Warfare. Obviously, I, I haven't posted too much lately. Um, or any other videos for that matter. Um, since early September, I kind of ran out of footage. Um, I recorded a lot thereafter, but a lot of it isn't necessarily salvageable. Um, I posted the three Bomberman videos, um, but you may have noticed a lot of noise in the background. That's because I filmed it during my birthday party. Um, I have some video footage for Doom 2, which is actually a lot worse as far as the background noise. Um, I have footage for Spider-Man the arcade game, but we can't even use it right now because I have to sit there and really edit it and sync it up. It's it's a long story. So I'm working on new things. Um, there may be future episodes for Borderlands 2. Um, a series for Deadly Premonition is definitely uh, in the plan. And probably Clock Tower, the original Clock Tower on PlayStation 1, that is on plan too. But... No telling when those will happen, but it's it's in the plan. I recently got a gig at a at a realgamernews.com. That's news n e w z as a music reviewer. Um, it's unpaid, but it does keep me in the swing of writing things and keeps me in in the know of, of forthcoming music. Um, after joining, I had them post my first three reviews that I originally posted on tattoohodgepodge.com and one for my Tumblr page. Um, I've since given them four new reviews, and I'm working on the fifth one right now. It's um, it's just kind of taking me a little bit of while, uh, time. Um, 
here's a hint, it's the new Arion album. Um, I've had it for about a month now, and uh, I absolutely adore it. And it's just a matter of actually sitting down and writing out my thoughts. Uh, but if anyone wants to request a particular review, let me know what album, and I will try to obtain it and check it out. Just try to keep it fairly recent. Uh, within the last three months is preferable. I've delayed the Sonic Horde videos, which is the documentation, the video documentation of my music collection. Uh, I've been delaying it for time and time again due to uh, just general laziness. Uh, for a little while there was some disinterest in doing it. Um, there were certain things that were out of my hands, um, parts of my collection that were out of my hands, and certain things that I was waiting to get. Um, so now seems to be the time. I've pretty much gotten the first few letters of my uh, CD collection squared away. So I'm going to be working on it sometime soon. Um, I just can't guarantee when. For the Riflex, uh, I know I've been saying since last February when I posted the preview thing, um, it's going to be re-recorded. Um, Pat decided that he was not uh, entirely pleased with the product that we had. Um, and a lot of these sound quality bits didn't really match up, so we want to re-record it in one shot. And, uh, and get it done entirely. We want to change a few jokes, make it a little bit more, um, I don't want to say PC, but just to kind of clean it up a little bit. And uh, finally, for the Arcade of Futility, um, of the games to be included in Season 1, I've got all the video material for about 4 out of 10 of the games. Uh, I haven't had the energy to tackle a new game lately, so it's been kind of on the back burner. Um, the episodes themselves are being written, though, so um, hopefully when I finish writing them, I'll easily be in the swing of finishing up those certain games. There's only there's only going to be five episodes to season one, um, and some of the games I actually don't even intend to play. I intend to borrow someone else's footage, which I will you know, obviously contact them for, but I still have to work on three complete games or so. So I suppose that's enough of an update, uh, considering the extent of my weekly endeavors in the last few months. Uh, keep your eyes peeled for more, subscribe to my channel, and keep doing what you're doing. I bid you adieu.